A university is not something that one simply opens, like a savings account or a jar of pickles. Any self-respecting academic institution was doubtlessly opened long ago by dignified people who wore bowler hats and spoke via subtitle, The world is a creation of the past, and it is our job to keep it all going and try not to touch anything. I saw you. keeping thank you in lecture theatre. students for Scientography. Sir Nigel Bickleworth. Cheers, cheers! On Two Point Radio, forget what you are doing and give in to the saccharine melodies of my voice. I am Sir Nigel Bickleworth, and you may not know it, but you've just made a wonderful decision. The finest radio show in town, coming right up. Oh, starting in the science lab.
Janitor required for groundskeeping. Thank you. week on Sir Nigel Reviews, we'll be talking about a modern beat combo, a group that call themselves the Helium Baboons. I must admit, while it may not be my usual cup of beef tea, for contemporary mindlessness, and that's what this is, it was not as bad as most of today's dirge and drivel. Helium Baboons, not as bad as I feared they would be. Two shrugs out of a possible five.
data needed to unblock toilets. Lovely. It's time for Spill the Tea, where we take some finely dried hearsay from our shameless county and strain it for all the precious nectar we can. Education Minister Tarquin Foxbridge is under scrutiny for describing Two Points youth as ambitionless nitwits, and I can see why. I can only hope that it's an abridged form of the full quotation. It would be remiss of him to forget that they are also loud, foolhardy, Tress, smelly, and generally hopeless. Janitor needed to unblock toilets. Lovely. to make stacks of easy cash, but reading about stocks is really boring. Invest in Bungle Coin. It's like other fictional cryptocurrency, but with 40% less saturated fat.
monitor required for groundskeeping. Thank you. Janitor needed to unlock toilets. Lovely. Now, for the results of last week's sonnet writing competition, I must say I was appalled, if not surprised. They were lacking structure, they were lacking soul. Some of you wouldn't know an I am from a dactyl. We'll be rolling the competition on to next week, so send in your sonnets. They can't get any worse. needed to unblock toilets. Lovely.
in bathroom. My respect for those that choose chivalric and knightly pursuits. Well, it's really very large. The Bickleworths, after all, come from a rich and prestigious line of people on and near horses. That being said, feudal aristocracy use their hands far too much for my liking. The swordsmanship, the adventuring. Have you ever held a lance? It's a chore. If you're so important, why are you doing all that work? Rule smarter, not harder. Janitor required in bathroom. but not socially optional. that Agatha Sphere and the Orb Foundation are targeting the county's colleges in an attempt to appeal to a younger demographic. Those orb-happy loons must be subdued at all cost. But wasting their time trying to brainwash our brainless students seems like a terrific diversion. 
I'm so glad we found a use for our horde of unwashed undergraduates. Janitor required in bathroom. grounds are not a toilet. And now for the segment we call Agony Answers. You provide the agony and I'll provide the answers. This week's problem is from Helpless in Hogsport. I'm stuck in my bathroom. I think the door's on the <laughs> I'd start by contacting someone under less anonymous circumstances. Perhaps a friend or the local authorities. Best of luck and so on. The end of year results have been released. Luck won't help you now. Bye. 
enjoy your summer. I know I will. needed to unblock toilets. Lovely. Harrison Wolf on Two Point Radio. Congratulations, you found me.
It's the Wolfman, Harrison Wolf, bringing you the truth from an undisclosed location here on Two Point Radio. Let's start thinking some radical thoughts while you listen to a piece of pre-digested popular music. All right? All right. Let's talk about the news. The news is like tea leaves or constellations, or when you find a singular glove on a fence post in the park. You can't look at it straight on. You gotta read between the lines. So when I say people in Hogsport can expect some minor flooding over the next week, what am I really saying? Think about it.
students should make a good first impression. No pressure. I see Jumbo McNally is sticking with the hard sell on the humbly named Jumbo University. If I was looking for an education, it sure wouldn't be from that guy that sells the nuts. That information, unlike Jumbo University, was totally free. You're welcome, listeners. but not socially optional. going to do with my life? I just don't know. Orb. Huh? What? Come to an Orb Foundation Learning Center and replace your mind with the power of the Orb. Oh, amazing. I'll do that then. Thanks.
God he's a temple, and he wouldn't fill a temple with crisps. back, but I was never really gone. What do you think I do while you're all listening to music? You probably think I eat a biscuit or go for a little walk, and sure, sometimes I do do that, but in a different sense, nothing could be further from the truth. Here's some more music while I do something totally unexpected. is a temple, and you wouldn't fill a temple with crisps.
I've been playing some new video games recently and man has it been a while. The last time I played video games, you were a tiny hexagon and you had to chase a squirrel to the top of the castle or something like that. Anyway, I tried that new Meat Wizard game everyone's going on about and boy, what a ride. Who knew that being a spell-casting, salami-wielding sorcerer would be so much fun? Let me say it out loud. <laughs> Results published. Why is robotics such a popular career path for kids these days? I tell you, I'm seriously concerned that we're losing our perfectly understandable fear of the machines. I mean, don't you see what's happening? When you build a robot, you're working for the robots. We gotta make a stand. Join me in flushing my doorbell down the toilet. United we stand, together we flush. Thank you. 
believe that smell is you. Janet are needed to unblock toilets. Lovely. We're just finishing up for today. I hope it was everything you dreamed it would be. Think about it next time you're sleeping and all the false realities drop away around you, leaving you playing chess with a sassy hat stand, finally feeling the real unfiltered truth. See you around. Janitor required in bathroom. needed to unblock toilets. Lovely. are needed in dormitory.
Student requests are often heard, but not always listened to. I'm DJ Shorts, the host giving you the most on Canvas Radio. It's been too long, and I've been dying to play this next song. See if you notice what they do on the ninth bar in the second verse. Oh, it's really something. We'll be back after this. questions. I believe that smell is you.
even goes to the student union. When I want a milkshake, I don't want a pint of milk made. It's so artificial, I just can't take it anymore. I'd much rather go a little off the beaten path and try something local. And preferably very lumpy. Anything from the stomach churn of dairy and smogly is sure to be nice and separated. Now that's a milkshake. Weather report. Oh look, it's raining. are needed to unblock toilets. Lovely. Now, a segment about a student taking an exam. Percy had been up all night preparing for an important test. He'd done the revision, he'd set his alarms, but then, some hours later, disaster struck. It was as he finished his paper that he realised he hadn't been using a pen. He thought he was dotting I's and crossing T's, but sadly, he was just making gestures with his hand over a piece of paper. It's a nightmare for so many of us, but today, it was Bertie's reality. Frequently asked questions, I believe that smell is you.
that are needed to unlock toilets. Lovely. Students eating rubbish are reminded that you are what you eat. Get some gubbiny grub in your gob with cheesy gubbins. The essence of cheese. Ch -ch 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 gubbins. Cheesy gubbins. You know you want to. Thank <laughs> you.